Walter Iverisht. Welcome along to another video from Gundog and Fly. And today I'm going to be doing a couple of important things um, with Rua. Now, any of you who've been watching the training regime will know that I've done quite a lot with her already, given her tender age. She's just over seven months. And um, to summarise, basically, what I've been doing is getting her to recall. I've been doing some... Um, firing some shots with the blank firer progressively louder and closer to her that's going very well and as part of that actually today i'll be firing the shotgun well um i'll be actually shooting over her if you like i'll be actively shooting with her and i don't believe i'll have any issues where the shotgun is concerned the other thing is um retrieving now she's a setter she's not a retriever although some setters will retrieve. I've had setters that would retrieve every time, and I've had setters that would retrieve at random, just now and again. You could shoot maybe, let's say, six snipe in a day, and they might retrieve two of them and just ignore the other four. It's a curious thing with setters. Now, I've done a little bit of work with Rua up to now, and it's not looking like she's going to be a natural retriever. Um, now. In saying that, I've seen young pups like her who wouldn't retrieve at her age and then went on at some point, just out of the blue, started to retrieve. It's a curious thing with setters. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do a small bit of work here in the yard and then I'm going to head out into the countryside and uh, hopefully shoot a snipe and see what her reaction will be. So be sure to stay along for the action. Now, I'm going to find out whether Rua will actually retrieve or not. And then, um, what I've done here is I've tied on, the cable tied on, a couple of snipe wings onto this dummy here. So, let's find out who she retrieve. I think it's unlikely, but given what I've seen from her so far. Rua, what's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Yeah, as I predicted, I don't think she's going to retrieve. No, not looking likely at this stage. Let's try her out once more. Good girl, good girl, good girl. Good girl, she picked it up and a good girl, she wants to bring it to bed. Good girl, Rua. Good girl. Good girl. Girl. Now that's a hopeful sign. Whoa. Now I know where she's going to bring it to if she picks it up in there, so I'm going to intercept her if she does pick it up again. Let's hope she picks it up again. No. No. No, she's not picking it up. God, no. I don't think she's going to retrieve, but I'm going heading out the country now and maybe shoot a snipe for her. And Again, I don't think she's going to retrieve that either. That's of course assuming I can shoot one. Once more. Ooh. Go on, pick it up. No, not going to happen, it looks like. Anyway, I'm heading off out the country now and uh, stay with me and we'll see what happens. I know where he is, so I'll be back to him shortly. Good girl! Good girl! 
Good girl. Now, let's have to cross back over that bridge. And I'll bring her downwind to the bird. And let her go and see what happens. So stay with me. Come on. Come on. Come on. A bit of a shaky bridge. My bird is just out there. So, um... I'm just going to hold on to her for a second and then I'm going to let her go downwind of the bird and hopefully she'll pick it up but from what I've seen in the yard at home it's unlikely so my bird is just over there so she should be at the window from there you got a roof Ruba, Ruba, here, here, Ruba. Now, yeah, come on, come on. Here, Ruba, Ruba. No, she's not going to retrieve. Not on this occasion, anyway. No, definitely not. Try once more. Ruba, 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 Ruba. No, no retrieve. So um, I'll talk a bit about that later on. So there you go, folks. That was it. Um, I don't know, a bit of a mixed bag, I suppose. Um, I have to try and look at the positives in it. I fired shots. Well, I fired one shot over her with the shotgun she was just to my left when i fired at that snipe there she paid no heed whatsoever to the shot so i have to look at that as very much a positive i can shoot at any point now and there's no problem with um, gunfire so that's accomplished that's something in the bag if you like as regards the retrieving as you could see on the video no no interest once the bird is dead and down she has no interest that's just the way it is it's likely that she'll be like that for the rest of her life, if you like. And there's also the possibility that she could at some point just start retrieving out of the blue. I've seen it happen. So that's it, folks. Um, she's only a young dog. She's only seven months old. I'm actually shooting over her now. as I, I um, That was my ambition when I started training her earlier on this year, that I wanted to be able to shoot with her this season and actually shoot game over her. She is a great dog to hunt. She has boundless energy and drive bird crazy and well able to find birds has a, a, a super nose she can window snipe at incredible distances and the way she works them is absolutely beautiful to watch and that's is in, in in a nutshell that's what i really want i'm not that fussed about shooting that much game i just like to watch the dog work to see her natural instincts at work and um, that's what fascinates me with the dog so that's it folks um, that's uh, a big big steps if you like today um, I'll probably get out a couple of more days over the rest of the season there's not a whole lot left of the season but I'll be out a few more times with her so I'll be recording that for you as well so Shina Willow I'm saying no that's it for me today by my kind to reach live got a mahagui a sock for cold loiter slong of oil